As a photographer, my mission is simple, document moments. And in the fleeting season of fall, this mission takes on a certain urgency. These golden canopies draw photographers from every corner of the world. We're all chasing something vanishing. And in these moments, our calling comes alive. Because like everything in life, these scenes will pass, leaving only memories and hope for more. With our cameras, we have the power to immortalize what's temporary, to capture what's slipping away. So we wander, we scour, seeking fragments of wonder to frame, to preserve, to share, and maybe more than anything, so that when we reach the end of our journey, our memories will live on. I know I'll be asked by friends and family, how was your trip? And answering that question means sifting through the memories, both the quantity and the quality of each moment, which then by human nature, we rank these experiences into a list of highlights to share. And for me, these highlights come alive in the photos I capture and the videos I share here on this channel. So today, we're gonna to slow things down as I share with you the moments that rise to the top of both of these lists. In the last part, I mentioned that I was gonna be leaving Colorado for a few days to visit some lifelong friends. And when I returned, the speed of this changing season really hit me hard in because it seemed like fall had come and gone in those four short days. The vibrant scenes that I'd hoped to capture had faded and photo opportunities became few and far between. So then why? Are these still some of my favorite moments, you might ask? And it's because these moments weren't just moments I experienced to share with the world. They were moments I shared with someone very special to me. And however cliche it might sound, my wife is truly my best friend. Fun fact, we're actually high school sweethearts and at the time of filming this, we've been happily married for five and a half years. I've longed for a day to share scenes like this with her and fate would have it that the time finally came.
drop them on that side because they're all kind of... I think what you were doing this right there is going to be perfect. Kind of scooching them in? Uh-huh. Okay, you're good. It's all the gold on it? Yeah. Yeah, there's little leaves like floating down. Uh-huh. It's really pretty. Okay, this fresh dropping like this, this is definitely what I wanted. Good. It actually doesn't even look too bad for two by three. It's just like a whole ton of foreground. Because it only shoots the high res is the two by three. So, and then you gotta go back and crop it. That's like the yeah. burns. Yeah.
We start with roots. Okay. A bunch of that, those leaves right there. Perfect, just like that. More? Uh, yeah, go ahead and throw some more. Perfect. There you go. What do I do now? Just let it catch. It's catching the leaves. <laughs> 